The Huawei P40 series has been available in the market for a while now and the Korean 990 5G chipset inside this smartphone was widely praised due to its powerful performance and also its gaming capability. In our review of the Huawei P40 at jamonline.ph, we were really happy with the performance that we got on the smartphone. And today, we're gonna discuss about gaming, we're gonna discuss about performance, yes, we're gonna discuss the best games on the Huawei P40 series smartphones. Hey guys, I'm Jam of jamonline.ph, welcome back to my channel, and today, we're gonna talk about the best games for your Huawei P40 smartphone. In case you want to download games on your Huawei P40 series smartphone, there's the Huawei app gallery that comes pre-installed on Huawei devices since 2018. But of course, it is still possible to install games from third-party app markets. For example, there's the app Go which is available right now on the Huawei app gallery. So the app lets you download applications that are not available on the app gallery. AppGo redirects you to third-party app stores like APK Pure in where you can download apps and install them on your brand new Huawei P40 smartphone. But before we talk about our favorite games on the Huawei P40 series, let's talk about the chipset inside the Huawei P40. So inside, there's the Kirin 990 5G SoC, which is pretty capable. In our review, we were pretty happy with the results that we got on the smartphone. As you can see in our game bench, we got a pretty good frame rates and also FPS stability on the smartphone when playing these heavy games. We also tested these games at the highest settings possible and the FPS stability proves that the smartphone is consistent when it comes to performance. When it comes to Antutu, we got a pretty high scores in here with a score of 483,967 which is already on a flagship level. And of course, we also got here a high scores on 3D Mark which proves that the smartphone can run 3D heavy games. Not just that, the smartphone also comes with 5G which means that you can download your games faster and you can have better latency when playing FPS games or MMOs on your Huawei P40. Now, let's proceed to our list. Our first game in the list is the Asphalt 9 Legends. I know, Asphalt 9 Legends is one of the most beloved franchises on smartphones. In case you're not familiar with it, it is a racing video game in where you compete with your enemies to be the number one in different tracks in the world. But of course, you can unlock cars from different car manufacturers and also unlock different tracks. Despite being released in 2018, the game is still one of the best racing games on smartphone not just in terms of gameplay but also when it comes to graphics. The Asphalt 9 Legends is now available on the Huawei App Gallery. Our next game in the list is Fortnite. I know a lot of people are, are already familiar with Fortnite as this is one of the most popular games right now in the market. So in case you're not familiar about Fortnite, Fortnite is one of the most popular battle royale games in the globe right now and it lets you fight with other 99 players to compete for the number one spot. It's one of the most demanding games out there for mobile as this is a cross-platform game that is also available on the consoles and PC. Thankfully, the Korean 995 g chipset of the Huawei P40 series smartphones can run this game really well. You may download Fortnite on your Huawei P40 series smartphones using the Epic Games app that is available right now on the Huawei app gallery. If you're the type of person who wants to play some puzzles, you know, just to test out your mind, you would probably love this game uh, in our number 3 list. So this one is Brains Out. So Brains Out is a game for all ages as the game gives you some puzzles, which is a little bit tricky for most people. Brain Out is now available on the Huawei app gallery. I know this is not a 3D heavy game, but I really love playing this game. I mean, it's a there's a lot of quirks. There's a lot of things to do with Brains Out. Naruto Slugfest is the newest MMORPG that is authorized by TV Tokyo and if you love Naruto then you would probably love this game. It's a 3D open world game and just like any other MMORPGs you can get to do quests, you could travel in places, you could get to meet some characters at Naruto the anime and of course the Naruto Slugfest like 
you know, you would probably love this one if you love Naruto and the characters with it. I mean, the stories, the quest, the action, everything is here in the Naruto Slugfest. The game is now available on the Huawei App Gallery. Another game that is based on the TV series is our number 5 on the list. This is Game of Thrones Beyond the Wall. The game is based on the popular TV series from Game of Thrones. And with Game of Thrones Beyond the Wall, you get to command the Night's Watch. And of course, you could get to play popular characters such as Jon Snow. And the game will let you build your own Night's Watch expand your characters, and fight enemies in a tactical-based combat. The game is now available on the Huawei App Gallery, and yes, it might be a tactical game, but the graphics of this one is pretty good. Number 6 in our list is probably one of the games that the fans would really love, and it's Honkai Impact III. So, the game is actually pretty addicting to their fans, and of course, the game is an action-filled game that features an amazing gameplay experience. If you love action games with pretty good graphics and effects, the Honkai Impact III is the one for you. This might have a pretty demanding graphics, but the Huawei P40 screen 990SoC can handle the game pretty well. The game is now available at the Huawei App Gallery. Now, let's proceed to our number 7, which is actually one of my favorite games right now on smartphones, and this is PUBG Mobile. PUBG Mobile is one of the best Battle Royale games out there, and the game is the mobile version of the popular player unknowns Battlegrounds on PC, which is a game that popularizes the Battle Royale genre. The game is one of the most demanding titles on smartphones, but the Kirin 995G chipset can handle that game just fine. Personally, it's one of my favorite games out there. And yes, you can download PUBG Mobile on third-party app stores. The next one in our list is Call of Duty Mobile. Call of Duty is one of the most popular franchise in the world right now, and as expected, Call of Duty doesn't disappoint as the game features a 5v5 deathmatch mode, which is perfect for those people who just want a fast-paced shooter game when they are bored. And of course, there's the Battle Royale mode in where you can fight in solo or teams and to compete as the last man standing in the game. Call of Duty Mobile can now be downloaded on third-party app stores. And yes, it does work perfectly fine on the Huawei P40. Just like the other games in our list, we're getting here another mobile version of a very popular PC MMORPG, and yes, it is Black Desert Mobile. Black Desert Mobile is the mobile version of the Black Desert Online that is now available on PC. Black Desert Mobile is an MMORPG that features one of the best graphics on smartphones right now, thanks to its extreme character customization, effects, and the graphics in-game. The actions and battle were pretty awesome too in the game and there's so much to do in game including fishing, there's battling enemies, you could create your own base, and many many more. The game is also available on third party app stores. Lastly, we got here Mobile Legends Bang Bang. I know, this is kind of popular right now in the Philippines. Actually, it is the most popular mobile game right now in the Philippines and it's a 5v5 mobile game in where you can choose your favorite heroes and of course, defend your own bases. The game might not be available for now in the Huawei app gallery but you can download it on a third party app market and you can play this game really well on the Huawei P40. So there we go, those are just some of the games that are available and running pretty well on the Huawei P40. And if you're curious about some of the other games or you just want to try out the other games on the smartphone, then that won't be a problem because you can still run games that you can find on third-party app stores because again, the smartphone is still running on Android with EMUI skin. What I really like on the Huawei P40 is the consistency of its performance and the power that we're getting on the chipset. Compared to other chipsets, the Huawei P40 screen 995G SoC perform better because despite playing games on the smartphone for a longer time, we can get a consistent frame rate as seen on the FPS and FPS stability in our game bench table earlier. And of course, we could also get better thermals on this one despite gaming on the smartphone for a longer time. 
Another feature that I really like on the Korean 995G chipset of the Huawei P40 is that it's built on 7 nanometer plus EUV fab, which means that the smartphone has a better power efficiency but still have a very powerful performance. And of course, they have a powerful NPU with dual big core and tiny core inside that is very powerful when it comes to AI. When it comes to gaming, there's the 16-core Mali G76 GPU that can handle most games on the smartphone really well. There's UFS 3.02 which gives a better and faster memory performance and of course it lets you load games really fast along with its LPDDR4X RAM support. So there we go, we definitely enjoyed playing games on the Huawei P40 smartphone thanks to the Kirin 995 g SoC that is really powerful and of course it comes with 5G for better gaming, latency, and faster network speeds. And again, most of the games that are available right now on Android will not have any problems running on the Huawei P40. And of course, that Kirin 995 g SoC it's really powerful. And I guess that's it for our discussion about our favorite games on the Huawei P40. So if you like this video, of course, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. And of course, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, be sure to click that subscribe button along with that bell button to get notified of the latest videos here at the Jam Online YouTube channel. So once again, I am Jam of JamOnline.ph. Thank you for watching and see you guys again in my next video.